Welcome back to another cosplay video for Farming Simulator 25 and today we're going to have a look at creating custom courses. Currently there is only one way to create custom courses as of recording this video and that is to record them manually. In the future hopefully they will add back the option to draw them on the map but for now I'm going to show you the current option. Um, so what you want to do is open up the HUD that's using either the delete button or if you have it enabled right clicking the mouse button and then we're just going to use this little record symbol and then you uh, just drive and draw out your field you want. I'm on Ola Halador's awesome frontier map to test this out. Perfect for this kind of map where fields don't exist and you uh, you need to create your own field and maybe you don't want to do that manually so we can just go ahead draw our field however big we want to do it um, and then we can set a course play worker to work to create that field for us so there we go that will do that and then if we hit stop it will ask us if we want to save the recorded course as a custom field and we do yes and there we go that is our field saved um, but nothing shows up currently but what you can see is on the mini map we do have the little cp1 option and then if we go in to here And then escape out of everything we can then click on the cp1 we can rename it to our custom field um, and if we want we could delete it i'm not going to do that because i want to show you it in action um so just to double check to show you that again we go into the course field um, and then I just hit escape to get rid of everything and then we can click on it and do whatever we want. So and then if we want to create a course on this field, we go into the field, target position we will have as um, go just in front of us, field position just here, field work settings, um, Multiple tools, we'll do one tool, two headlands, narrow fields deactivated, start working on the field center, sharpen corners deactivated, generate field work course, there we go. So I'm going to escape out of this because we're going to start it from in the game because I want to enable create fields. Um, so we're going to hit Y to enable create, create fields. We are going to start at the first waypoint. I'm going to turn on everything. And then hit go. And off we go. Uh, you probably want to make sure you're inside your new field to, uh, to hit that. Now, you might want to actually... Uh, run the headland first with this you know because you're creating a new field I don't know it's up to you but I'm gonna let the game run generate our new field and uh, I'll be back with you at the end
there we go. In not too long, we have our custom field. So something you should note. The tractor is driving on the line, so you need to allow for the width of the implement. Um, something we will then check is... Right, because I've not done this before, how does Courseplay handle it? Once you've created the custom field with creating courses on it um, with other implements. Because that's an interesting question. And maybe we'll make this video a little bit longer. Um, let's grab another tractor with a different size implement, shall we? Nothing like being prepared, hey? So let's grab a trusty a four meter cultivator not a three meter one i know disappointing i am sure uh we need a at least 150 horsepower tractor so, um, that'll do there we go so if we go in here now and maybe actually this is where we want to have turned off prefer custom fields because we might want cause play to calculate the field itself. Let's have a little look at this, shall we? We will learn together. So, uh, field work settings. Number of headlines. Let's just do a couple of headlines. Let's just quickly generate a course. And if we just start this up, first waypoint, and see what she does. Yeah, so let's just quickly change that. to deactivate it. Uh, go back in here, delete that, no course. Yeah, because then it's finding its own course boundary, own field boundary. So then uh, generate the course. Yeah. Start at first waypoint, start job. And yeah, so we have learned something. Once you've drawn your field, you probably want to change it to um, not prefer custom fields. And actually you might even want to then delete your custom field. And you could leave it in there just for reference, but um, in terms of settings in the game, and if you've not watched all the way to the end of the video, you won't have seen this bit. So, but yeah, you want to deactivate prefer custom fields, which is not what I was expecting. So a little bit of a bonus there if you've watched all the way to the end. Um, let's just move our doits out of the way. And if you've commented about that, I will refer you to the last few minutes of the video. So if you've enjoyed the video, click the like button. And uh, if you've got any other comments or questions or suggestions, stick them below. Thank you to the patrons and YouTube channel members. Appreciate you guys supporting the channel. And there will be more tutorials and things to come. See you next time.